First, open a new video project. Head over to the Elements tab and search for Orthogonal Grid. Under Photos, choose one that works for you and add it to your page. Increase its size to cover the page. Then, click on the background and change the color to a dark gray. Duplicate the grid image and place it directly over the first one so the entire page is covered. Hold Shift, select both grids, and group them together. Now, reduce the transparency to around 30%. Back in Elements, search for a map and add it to your page. Duplicate this page. Select the map on the first page, rotate it to minus 145 degrees, and drag it to the top left corner, leaving just a sliver of the map visible. Add a match and move transition and increase the duration to one second. Next, open the edit timing panel and set it to 3.0 seconds. Apply this to all pages. Duplicate the page again. Now scale up the map so you can zoom in on the area you wanna highlight. Apply another match and move transition, one second duration. Duplicate the page. Then go to Tools, choose the marker. Use it to trace the country border. You can adjust the weight and transparency if needed and zoom in for precision. Once you're done, close the toolbar. Go to Animate. Choose the Wipe animation. Set it to Enter only and decrease the speed for a smooth effect. Next, duplicate the page. Hold Shift, select the map and the drawing and move it to the next destination. Again, Add a match and move transition around one second. Duplicate the page. Press C to add a circle. Make it smaller and place it over your first destination. Set transparency to 80% and animate it using the pop animation, enter only. Duplicate the circle. Make it even smaller for the second destination. Then press L to add a line. Place it over the two circles. Increase the stroke weight. Switch it to dash lines and make it curved. Trim the line so it appears after the large red circle and apply a wipe animation. Adjust direction accordingly. Then trim the small circle so it appears after the line. Duplicate the page one last time. Go to position. Hold shift on the keyboard, select all elements and delete them. Zoom out on the map to showcase the surrounding regions and provide a broader perspective. And add a match and move transition. Now, trim the previous page elements so they end right when the zoom out begins. Let's fine tune the duration of each page. Page 1, 2.6 seconds. Page 2, 1.7 seconds. Page 3, 1.8 seconds. Page 4, 1.9 seconds. Page 5, 1.3 seconds. Page 6, 3.2 seconds. Final page, leave as is. And this is the final result. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and let me know what you want to see next. Until then, happy creating.